I first came to the community centre with my kids. Then I met the people in Time Builders and they seemed like such nice people. Then the time of Corona came. First of all, my boyfriend lost his job. He got paid cash in hand so he couldn't get any furlough money. When he didn't get paid that first month, we just needed help. Then I found you and you have really helped me a lot. I mean really a lot. In eight weeks we have had lots of food, even non-essential food, even sweets for the kids as well. Before the food parcels, I don't know how we managed. I was trying to borrow money from my friends, but that was only like £20 a week. It's not enough. And we had to then pay it back, which was leaving me short again the next week. I don't know how we would have coped. We stopped getting working families tax credit and had to try and claim universal credit. My boyfriend was earning £800 a month before, so we didn't get housing benefit or anything. That was paying for everything, rent, bills, food, anything else we needed. I tried so many places to get help. I even called the city council to tell them I was desperate and they told me there was no chance and that I still needed to pay full rent and council tax. They didn't help us at all. Time Builders was the only place that's helped us. I hope all the people getting help from Time Builders manage to sort their problems out. But there's no shame in asking for help. I'm asking for food, not money or clothes. There's no shame in that. It's better to ask and to get help. We can't wait to come back to Time Builders. Every time we go to the park, my kids are asking when we can go back. Maybe I could even volunteer when all my kids are at school. I want to get a job and it might help with my confidence.